Or she cleared it down instead of up. But she's fine now. Proof is in the pudding. Here's Mau Mau. She is fine. Yeah, I know. Oh, meow meow. Thank you. Lay down. Lay down. Okay. What were we doing? We were collecting plort. Uh. Hi, meow meow. Lay down, mama. Yeah, lay down. There we go, good girl. So even though pink plort doesn't seem to be that valuable anymore, it does seem like it is relatively necessary for a lot of things. Okay. Can I make another one of these? Yeah. I'm gonna let my character go to sleep because I'm trying to be nice to her. Oh boy, these guys are all full up. Well, maybe my character is not going to sleep, but we'll see. Maybe I'll give her an hour of sleep. Dang. Well, if I do that, and then... I never thought about that before. <laughs> ah, genius. You think you would need quantum floor for making teleporters because of how they work. Maybe that is the case, but it seems like it was mostly pink. Yeah, you don't even use Quantum Floored at all, except for this one, the Butterscotch Teleporter. Hmm. It's silky sand. Well. Whoop. <laughs> Let's go... See if we can sell these right now. Dervish and Quantum. Yeah, sure, why not? And let my character sleep for like three hours. Two and a half ish. Oh, I guess it was six and a half. Range exchange is offline? But why? Maybe just because it's so early in the morning. Okay, so now I need to go to the forest, put down more apiaries, and this teleporter. So that way I can get there and back again. With ease. Oh, this way. Okay. Bum, bum, 
Put the teleporter right here. Stall. Okay. And... Can I put... Uh... Oh, I can go up there, though. Put the other apiaries up here. Oh, bollocks. And save these slimes from their own destruction. Well, you're the Tardos that keep eating all the plort you can shove in your mouth. Yeah, that honey's what I need, yo! I'm afraid to do this one because I don't want it to give me something that I can't carry. But we look like we're doing good, okay. I need to put down the other one to activate that, so until I can do that, let's run home. And let's get rid of this tabby slime. Whew! My character just went really fast for a second. Maybe it was just lag, and then it sped up, but it was really quick. Bum 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 Perfect. Alright, and now we can go to the forest and back from the forest. Oh, hey, look, you're ready anyway. Oh, no, you're not. Okay, y'all's just heckin' working. Okay. I'm excited about this now. Oh my gosh, I'm like a heckin' scientist, bro. Time to get drones! Uh, yeah, I think we should have enough pink floor over there. Let's do it! <gasps> Two drones? No, I need more wild honey. Dang it. Well, at least I have one. Where's the most important place? I think... Mm. Okay, what I need to do is put the phase lemons over here. So that way the drone can take the phase lemons to the dudes. Uh, remove crop. Okay. I think, though, didn't they like the odd onions? Or do they also like the oka oka? Oh, too much to try to remember. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, rad slime likes the oka oka. Okay, perfect. We'll just keep that for the rad slime. That'll work out. Need this. Put it there. Put the rest of this in 
there, even though they're clearly not hungry. And then... I'm gonna put my drone here. Hi, cutie! How do I do a thing? Oh, there we go. Activate. Uh... Target. Um... Fruit. Source. Garden. Destination. Corral. No, auto feeder. Drone can only operate in one ranch expansion. How will it know which one to take the fruit to is what I would like to know, though. Does he need battery? Is he out of energy? Drone program. Target fruit from garden take it to the auto feeder, but which auto feeder is he going to take it to? Because these guys only like veggies. Hmm. Let's try it the other way. See if maybe he's just sleeping because there's nothing there yet. Target veggies from the garden to auto feeders. Yeah, okay, so he was sleeping because there wasn't anything there, but what auto feeder is he gonna bring it to? Like, does he know that they don't, like, I thought you could be like, target a specific fruit for a specific feeder, but apparently not. I'm gonna waste some time watching him because I want to see this process. Haha, <laughs> so cute. I think he just goes to the closest one. Okay. Now my other question is, if that gets all filled up... Will he start trying to bring it to the other one? Hmm. Or maybe now that he's bringing it to that one, the other one will bring it to the other one? I don't think so. I think maybe... I need to switch the containments, but I didn't want the dervish to be around anybody. Because they... The dervish can cause tornadoes, and the... Quantums can teleport, so it's like you don't want them to be near any other slimes. These guys are just radioactive and cause crystal formations that explode. So... They're a little bit more contained. Dang, I wish... I wish I knew. Well, let's go see if the range exchange is back online. Also, let's get done with these. Oh, there's still a couple. Uh, 
Alright, we can plant something there at a later date. What this does mean, though, is that I need to have crops near the different slimes. Which means I am gonna have to waste a couple thousand gold. <laughs> okay, so those guys will eat veg, and the rest of them eat fruit. So we need to grow fruit in here. And specifically, cube berries. Hi, Meow Meow. Please don't throw up on me. Okay, good. You went back to sleep. Um. Hmm. They eat meat as well. Phosphorus. What's up here? Oh, nothing's up here. Okay. Ugh, I hate to do it, but... Garden... They like the odd onions? They do. Okay, cool. We'll put our odd onions in here. And then we'll have a drone that can bring veggies to there, theoretically, and fruit to these two, theoretically. Okay. In theory. Okay, I got 30 more minutes. So I'm just reorganizing my farm. I wish there was a way where you could just move the plot. I mean, we've got the science to create unlimited resources from one resource, but we don't have the science to move them. We also have the science to create a vacuum that doesn't kill things. That or slimes don't need to breathe. That is another option. Okay. Remove crop. I forgot I need to upgrade them too. Soil and sprinkler. What? Now my only worry now, gosh dang it, is that they're going to bring that fruit to them and this veggies to these guys. Which is not going to work. <sighs> hmm. It's very frustrating. Uh, just because I don't know. Not necessarily because I think it's going to be a problem, but I just don't know. I have a lot of money. Okay, I need to go... Well, one. Let's just get rid of the rest of these carrots. can put lemons. Uh, I think there was actually a spot that I had them saved, but I'll just put them here. Okay. And then 
portal. Boink. It's so dangy to be here at night. Okay, ten more seconds. You're ready though. You're ready now. Okay. And then we go up here. You're ready. And you're ready. Okay, and then I just go bye bye to those crazy guys. And then I go do science. The music can go away like any time now. There we go. Okay. And then we can test the theory of how the drone works, I guess. Well, I had enough to make two. Okay, so we need another drone. Mm. Let's test the theory in here. Alright, let's do one here. That brings... the fruit to there, and then... or the veggies, I should say. And then one here... that does the other. Okay, so you are going to bring fruit from the farm to... the auto feeder. And you are going to bring vegetables from the farm to the auto feeder. And the fruit and the veggies aren't ready yet, so we will let that sit. I wonder, maybe if they're like, it's already in the auto feeder, they'll just keep bringing it there. That's likely, actually. I haven't gotten any mail in a long time. Range exchange. Uh, let's help out Mochi. My ranching skills are gonna make you squirm, wiggle worm. Okay, Mochi, whatever you say. I don't know what that is, though. One crystal, one hunter, and fire. Some sort of fire. Okay, well. Crystal plur. Actually, I might have some up here. No, we've got honey plort. I don't actually know why I went this way. I know that the hunter plort's over here, but I meant to get the crystal first, but oh well. Okay. Okay. So 
this is honey and boom. I don't even know what slime makes fire, though. It's my real problem. I clearly don't have that slime, whatever that is, but I've seen it somewhere. Let's... No, that's not what I wanted. Boom. Quantum. Lucky. Largo. Feral. Okay, well there's definitely... One, two, three, four, that I haven't seen yet. Hmm. Resources. There's a vegetable slash fruit that I haven't seen yet. And a chicken. A couple chickens I haven't seen yet. Hmm. And two places that I haven't been yet. Let me see. Fire slime. Minecraft Pokemon. Wow. Slime Rancher. There we go. Fire slimes are primarily encountered during solar anomalies in the desert. Ah. Okay. So I just need to go hang out there and hope for the best, I guess. Probably should sell this right now, but oh well. I think I had Honey Plort already on the other side. Again. Oh well. Okay, I got there through the forest. And this way. Nope, that's the way I came in. This way. Probably should have made the other teleporter. And just put it over here. Because this... Well, there's a teleporter home at least. But it would be nice to have a teleporter at the end of this. Uh, so I could just get there and not have to go through all this puzzles. But luckily the puzzles are very easy. And I had the pattern memorized when I was playing it before. So I just need to get back on it. I'm guessing right now, but this is like the way that I remember. Ah, I'm out of energy, okay. Yeah, this is totally the way. Okay, and then I needed to go down, get that, and then I could use this to get up. There we go. And here we are. I don't think I can open that one yet. Nope. I usually just hide during the fire anomalies, or solar anomalies, so that's why I've never seen them. But I must have got there plored at some time on accident, I guess. Uh, 
Mosaic and Dervish and Pink in one spot. That's a disaster waiting to happen. Um, the teleporter back to the farm is in this next area, so I should just go over there and wait for the solar anomaly. Oh boy. Yeah, these oasises are great, except for the fact that they cause so much problems. So, yeah, because there's always mosaic and pink and dervish, and then eventually they cause problems. Alright, so this is where the teleporter is. Oh, hey! I'll take you guys home. <laughs> Forgot I left you here. And in theory, we'll be safe. So let's wait for a solar anomaly. The music is lagging, just kind of making my head hurt. But that's okay. I guess I can look up what they need for requirements, because I have a couple different places where I can put them. There's purple demon ones too? What? Oh, there's a solar flare. Considered a counterpart to the puddle slime. Oh, interesting. Rare breed of slime. Let you just about any food. The only way to feed a fire slime is to use an incinerator with an ash trough upgrade. Okay. Well, are there any fire slimes? I see other slimes. This seems dangerous. Stop, cat. I love you, but stop. Are those it? I don't think so. I think those are just scary things that will hurt you. Oh, I regret everything, but let's go. Mosaic. <gasps> There's something. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I got two of them. Well... Ah, okay. Three. I see why they would say they're related to the puddle slimes. Because they look just as adorable. Oh, here's a bunch. Four, five, six. Okay, and the anomaly has stopped. I'm not seeing any fire plort. Probably because I picked them up too quick. Alright, well. We will give them some food and they will be just fine. Okay, so what is the like requirements that they are needing? Ow. Uh, rare breed of slime that lives on ash. Fire slimes will eat just about any food, but not without being burned first into ash. That way, the only way to feed a fire slime is to use an incinerator with a ash trough upgrade. Fire slimes need ash to survive and will quickly snuff out if they are left 
on any other surface for too long. When keeping fire slimes in an ash trough, simply burn any food items to produce some ash and fill the trough. Oh. Uh, I guess this is what I got for my last house upgrade. C cool. <laughs> Thanks. Um, oh, well, I guess I should read the last little bit there. The, uh, danger to farmers. Fire slimes naturally burning state makes them bad companions for other slimes as their fiery touch will send a slime flying. Additionally, fire slimes and their plorts need to be kept in an ash trough under an incinerator or they'll quickly snuff out. If you need to deal with fire slimes directly, splash water on them. Hmm. Interesting. Um. Oh, I gotta grab the extra carrots that I don't need for like anything. Okay. So that means. That I'm gonna need to get rid of something. I think I will get rid of this guy. Incinerator. With an Ashtroph. Okay. And then, do I just... Okay, and it just makes Ash, just like that. Oh, where'd you go, buddy? But why? But why? Go. No. Oh my goodness. World's most difficult slime. Go. No. Oh my lordy. Try this one more time. There we go. Does that mean it's ash trough is full? I can't tell. I mean, it looked like it raised up. Hope I'm not just wasting carrots, but I probably am, but that's okay, because I have so many of them. Um, hi guys, please don't hurt me. I just want that the plort. Yep, just this. You guys can stay. No! Get, yep, get back in there. Go in. There you go. <laughs> okay, interesting. I've never gotten an incinerator because I didn't think I needed it and I was like, ugh, let's not waste money on that. But now I realize I do. Oh, crystal plur. Uh, and I'll just do that. Uh, crystal plur. Did I have crystal boys in here? Yeah. Hi, cat. <laughs> oh no. Six. Alright, he's doing something, but I don't know what he's doing yet. I'll have to go back and check out after I deliver this. Wow, that is just in the air. I thought it would be on the wall. <laughs> oh, well. Um, I think we should sell these first. Crystal is down, but that's fine. Okay, all but one. Just in case, like, whatever happens to pop out of that machine. I hate losing stuff, and I've already lost a couple things. Oh, it's mostly just fruit and veg anyway. Actually, it's all fruit. Cool beans. Uh, 
you guys like veggies, not fruit. Okay, uh, after being up for two days now, I think, I'm gonna let my character sleep. Oh, I got mail. The other ranchers won't shut up about you, and it's starting to get annoying. Wait, is that the new one? I guess it must be. And I just helped her out, so. So let's see what all the fuss is about. I like to talk business with you, so I went ahead and activated a spare teleporter in that horrible cave you call a ranch expansion. Teleporter will take you to my estate. I have others, too. Where you we can work out the details. Don't keep me waiting. See you there, square. Mochi Miles, top rancher. <sighs> I really don't like her. Like, at all. But, whatever. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh, it's gross. Okay. Oh, wait, I need to switch that off really quick. Well, that actually seems like a good place to leave it off because it's about time for me to go and it doesn't seem worth it boy shiny forehead for me to play for another like four minutes when I just unlocked Mochi so I can just have her be the beginning of the next episode so that's where we're gonna end for this evening thank you for joining me if you like what you saw go ahead and give me a follow and if you would like to see more content, you can check me out on YouTube at Meldaria88. If you want to send me any sort of messages or info or really cool things of, that you've played, uh, you can check me out on Facebook and on um, Twitter at Meldaria88. And of course, you can check out my library here on Twitch and... I would like to say have a lovely evening and Amberly says have a lovely evening and we will see you guys next time. Bye!